We're outside the International Community Pavilion at the AU Exhibits, and I'm here with Ray Eisenberg, and Ray's going to tell us a little bit about what's going on. So the Community Pavilion houses uh, 16 kiosks here that represent the, the customer communities involved with Autodesk products. Uh, they represent over one and a half million of our customers that are actually members of Autodesk communities. And the communities are vital to Autodesk because they bring their domain expertise to our product. It's not just product expertise, it's our domain, their domain expertise. So imagine uh, a Russian-speaking person working on laying pipelines and engineering oil pipelines in Siberia using Inventor. Uh, Autodesk doesn't have that knowledge, but our, com our customers in, through the communities do. There are many groups represented here in the International Community Pavilion, and I have Jeff Blom here to tell us about one such group called GBOG. Tell us about it, Jeff. Uh, GBOG is the Greater Boston Autodesk User Group. Uh, we're in Boston, Massachusetts. Uh, we've, been a, we've been a chartered user group for, uh, I think, 25 years, or 20, maybe about 20 years, and uh, it's been a pretty active group, and uh, we meet once a month, uh, 10 months a year, and we have a good time, and it's, uh, it's been very, uh, very effective. I'm here with Carlton and Jim, who have entered into a very interesting contest. I'm going to have them tell us about it. Carlton? Uh, we entered into the uh, Augie Top Dog Contest, where you test your knowledge about how, uh, how much you know about AutoCAD. Who do you favor tonight to win? Uh, I'm all in. I'm going to win it. I'm going to win it all. I got, I got 17 out of 35. Nobody can beat me. We're here with Francisco Nascimento, who is with the Brazilian user community, and he's got a message for his people. Okay, I think you should try to reach our website from Brazilian Autodesk community because it's very important to join and get us to exchange knowledge where people help people.